Are you ready? I guess. I don't look good. I look you look beautiful. I look tired and old. Where am I supposed to be looking? This is my mom. Hi, everybody. <laughs> you guys asked her to answer some questions, and we are finally getting around to it. So, welcome to this week's Hashtag Ask Taco every Monday. What is your mother's favorite meal to cook and why? Um, Don't my, think about my it. My favorite meal? Probably... To cook. To cook? It would probably be chili because it's easy to make and everybody likes it. And likes it's it. delicious. Actually, you made chili yesterday. I did. And it was delicious. I'll probably eat some before work today. That's good. What's the weirdest thing you did as a kid? Climbing a tree because nobody ever climbs tree anymore. trees anymore. Yeah, but that wasn't weird when you were a kid. No, it wasn't. I was pretty much the straight and narrow. I, I never did anything You're wrong. a nerd. I was a nerd. What's your favorite song as a kid? P.S. Your son is the best YouTuber alive. My first 45 was... What's um, your first 45? It's a, it's a small little record. You know, one of those little small Like a tiny things. record. And Well, it's like this big, and then it has a hole in it, and you put it down, and it's a 45. I don't know if it was my favorite song, but I know it was my first 45. It was Tony, Orlando, and Dawn uh, knock three times. I'm going to have to listen to that. Knock three times on the ceiling if you want me. <laughs> But then, of course, there was the other albums that I had, like the Carpenters and... The uh, Carpenters I like, actually. And then the Partridge Family. 45. Was, I've never heard. 45s and then um, albums. Mrs. Holmes. Oh, jeez. Don't call me Mrs. Holmes. <laughs> what is your favorite television show? You Back can... in the day? I think this is current. Really? Because back in maybe. the day was Happy Days, Happy and days. I got to meet Henry Winkler, who played the Fonz, Fonz, when I was 16, and then we went to the Smithsonian uh, uh, like 10 years ago, and I finally saw the true Fonzie jacket, and I called up my mother. Oh, I and, remember that. Yes. And we saw Dorothy's slippers, yes. too. Yes. But I called up my mom, and I said, Mom, my life is complete. I finally saw Fonzie's jacket <laughs> in real life. So what's your favorite show now? My favorite show now is... The Walking Dead? I love The Walking Dead, but um, I love The Housewives. I'm sorry, yes. You love Housewives? Well, yes, because I come <laughs> home from work, and I'm so, you know, I need to de-stress, so I watch <coughs> stupid reality at those shows. Yes. <laughs> to the Taco Mama, how do you feel about your son being called Taco? I don't have a problem with it. I mean, I actually got him a license plate that said R Taco, Taco H, H, but uh, he'll always be Ryan. As no. long as when he's not 50, everybody's still going to call him Taco. <laughs> I'm still going to have this taco tattoo on my arm. That's all right. Yeah, <laughs> that's all right. My arm's fine and I don't have a tattoo, so it, w it won't be sagging. Can you say forward backwards? Draw, draw, rough, draw rough, draw rough. Yeah. I tried to say that like when I first got this draw. question, and I could not. Do really? It. You look at it. D r a w draw and rough. Oh yeah, draw, draw rough. <laughs> Until the camera died. And while we were charging camera, my mom thought of the actual really weird thing that she did as a kid. And what was it? I used to dress my cat up in my old baby clothes. Weird. Bonnets and under <laughs> underpants and and we used to put it in the carriage <laughs> and push the cat around. Torment this yes. cat. That's a thing. So Mikey said, can you teach me how to make your chocolate covered peanut butter balls? Oh, Mikey. Better yet, I will make you you some but I will give you the recipe or you can come over with confectionery sugar peanut butter butter what else is in there graham crackers chocolate chips and I'll be happy to teach you how to make them oh and paraffin <laughs> wax that's the most important thing he's got paraffin wax oh <laughs> because um, that's what keeps the chocolate on the balls why haven't you taught Ryan how to be smooth with the ladies yet why the haven't I taught Ryan yeah he is smooth he just doesn't know how to be smooth I think that means I'm not smooth. Now he needs to have more <laughs> confidence in himself. What is the one item you've held on to since you were a child? Oh, that's a good question. That is a good question. That's As a, a matter of really fact, question. I still have my Muppet uh, puppet. It, oh, Ralph. brown thing. Ralph, yeah. I got him when I was seven, and I'm now 55, so it's an antique. antique I saw him antique. recently. Yeah, he's up in Ryan's room, as a matter of oh, fact. Oh, that's where it is. Yes. yes. Creeping on me in yes. the room. But yes, I've had that since I was seven years old. It's been mended many times. Yeah, I was just going to say that. He yeah. has been sewn up. I that. wish I'd 
known that because we could go get them, but maybe Ryan, maybe Ryan can do it in a skit. Taco and Ralph. Taco and Ralph. There you go. <laughs> Series coming next week. <laughs> Hi, Ryan's mom. Can you describe Ryan's dream wife without asking him? I would say that she has to be five six <laughs> or so. <laughs> Because he's five, I think, what, ten? Five, five, nine. Oh, yep. five, nine, okay. A little bit on the thin side, because Ryan is skin and bones. He doesn't eat enough. Um, beautiful eyes. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. A nice smile. Yes. Um, long hair, but it, I don't think it matters what color it is. Or it doesn't matter if it's long hair, really. And What kind of personality? Um, personality, I would say that she would have to make him laugh a lot. Mm -hmm. And that she can't put up with his crap. Meaning, like, if he starts treating her like crap, I would say... Bye bye. Well, that's not my dream wife then. Dream she wife. has to put up with all my crap. And she has to give me a lot of crap. <laughs> What's the funniest thing Ryan has ever done? Not the funniest thing, but the most dangerous thing that we can laugh about now yep. was when he and his brother and two friends were out on the bay. <sighs> In the winter time, they ended up <laughs> falling through the ice. That day was the first time I ever got a thermometer up my butt as well. Oh, really? Well, maybe yep. that was the funniest thing Ryan ever did then. <laughs> <laughs> Can you touch your eye with your tongue? Can I touch my eye? No. Try it. No. Oh. Mm-mm. All right. No. Oh. Do you ever shop at Walmart? If you do, do you get amused at people shopping there? Like all the weirdos? Well, you know what? If you have a day off or whatever and you want to go shopping, shop at Walmart. Walmart's That's the place fine. to go. Um, because you don't really care what you look like there because hopefully you don't bump into anybody that you know. And if you do know them, they're probably just going to look as bad as you. But Judge you know free what? zone at Walmart. I I'm on a mission when I am shopping, so I don't really pay attention to people, but I do treat everybody yeah, like pretty, you know, nice. I haven't seen anybody outrageously we don't, we dressed don't live, or undressed. We don't live in the South. That's that's kind of why. Oh, that's it. Oh, wow. Oh, that was okay. quick. Okay, that was easy All enough. right, if you guys want to see more of my mom, let us know below. Give a like. Yes, and more of your mother. More Oof. of my mama. Leave comments down below for next Ass Taco. Okay, that was easy. All that right, easy. gotta go now. All right, thank you, Mom. Love you. Okay, bye. Bye. Thanks, Mom. Bye. That was easy enough. Yeah, that was fun.